Greetings, gamers. I'm just chilling in Cedar Rapids. And Happy New Year and Happy Holidays and welcome back to a public gaming community. I feel like I need to remind you guys, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hey, let's get these conversations started because boy, we have so much to talk about. Well, let's actually just get down to the nitty gritty. So, while I've been hiding under my rock, it seems like KOF has had a couple of trailers, maybe two, and a couple of leaks, which kind of made sure they removed the whole silhouette day, because yeah, cat's out the bag. So we have Maxima closing out the team for K. And of course we have Kula closing out the team for Team Cronin. So we're gonna check out both those trailers and talk a little more detail. So let's start off with Maxima's trailer. Maxima. Team K Dash. Alright, yep, Maxima looks pretty much the same. I will admit, as usual, the design looks quite amazing, and I think it's impressive. Not gonna lie. SNK said, hey, we've been working really hard on this, and we just were doing so much to make sure we could perfect this, so yeah, they they definitely worked their asses off on this one. Great job, I think. Other than that, it seems like he actually has all of the same moves, except for he has one new move. So, hey, not too bad. At least we got something new. I don't honestly play with Maxima, so I don't think I'll ever be really trying him out. So let's go ahead and get on to Kula's trailer. Kula Diamond. All right, boy, she is a beaut. Yep, Kula looks great. I, I mean, again, here we are again with Maximus trailer. Same thing. There's one additional move, and everything else just looks pretty much the same. Now, I do know a little bit of lore about this move. Kula has a little snowman's falling down, and I think she actually had this move in KOF Maximum Impact. 
And that's a game I played maybe once or twice and didn't really like it. I was really excited about the idea of KOF going 3D, playing the Tekken game. But, uh, yeah, leave it to Tekken. But yeah, overall, I think she looks great, and that's cool. So, the last character on the list. Well, we already know, of course, it's Elizabeth. And here's what she'll probably look like if I had to guess, based on the leaked image that I'm showing you. Now, what's interesting is, you know, we can only take the leaks as a grain of salt. So, we don't know this to be true, but call me crazy but I'm gonna show you this leak image and it looks like we're gonna have another beta but I don't believe it to be true because the game is gonna be coming out in a couple of days so next trailer will probably be Elizabeth and then after that will probably be maybe another trailer before the DLC trailers and it's safe to say I just have this new feeling about KOF I really believe that what's gonna happen is they're gonna release Omega Rugal as the boss character of course showing us that hey you know they already hinted at him being in the game considering that they're having an omega version of the release so and i'm definitely buying that version so no worries i'll show you guys all the box info and i do this all the time but yeah i believe what they're also going to do is the two teams for dlc characters i think it's gonna be it has to be it just has to be rock Somehow, some way, it has to be rock from the Marco Gurus team. And some way, some way, some way, some way, it has to be Oswald. I'm looking at all the DLC characters from KOF 14, and they're already in the game, with the exception of Oswald, Naj, and Rock. I just have this strong feeling the first DLC characters are going to be free because they usually start off games with 40 plus characters. So this will probably make 45 characters that they're technically starting the game off with. So we'll see. But nonetheless, I need Shingo in the game. Somehow, some way, let's bring Shingo in the game. That would be really cool if the last character was actually Shingo instead of Rugal. Well, that's all I really got. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment below and tell me what do you think. Are you excited about Kula and Maxima? More ass characters. Are you ready for the last trailer? And are you ready to just play the damn game like me? Let's start that conversation down below.